an estimated 3.9 million cities, is lost annually to post-harvest losses since agriculture contributes about 54% of Ghana's GDP. Reducing harvest wastage is extremely important. President of the Peasant Farmers Association of Ghana, Charles Nyaba, is of the view Ghana has not made much progress in reducing post-harvest losses. To the president of the Peasant Farmers Association, Charles Nyaba, the warehouses that have been completed are limited and the facilities needed to address post-harvest losses are lacking. The one district, one warehouse specifically was to create storage facilities that will help combat losses that we incur after harvest. But unfortunately, that process has been very slow. As we speak, we have less than 30% of the warehouses completed. And those that are even completed are very limited. Some of them, the facilities or the components that goes with a, a warehouse to be able to address post-harvest losses are lacking. But he said current warehouses are good for cereal storage but need more facilities such as dryers, moisture meter testers and cold stores. Some improvements have been made in reducing sorghum and soya crop commodity wastage. He said even if all the facilities are provided, the marketing of crops is what should be focused on to prevent post-harvest losses, which is what is done to reduce sorghum waste. One crop commodity that we made some progress in terms of Post-harvest loss reduction is a sogum because uh, there's a guarantee market for sogum. And the private companies that buy the sogum made a lot of investment to improve the, the, the issue of post-harvest losses. The Ministry of Food and Agriculture is yet to comment on the issue.